I left corporate America about um, two years ago with the intention of becoming a life coach. And I enrolled in a program that um, I think covered very broad strokes of what it meant to be a coach and then focused on how to build your business. And the more I started kind of preparing to start the program, the more I realized that it was missing some key elements. Um, a, a video by Mark David popped onto my Facebook screen and it was an introduction to an introduc an introduction to um, the eating psychology course and food had never really been on my radar I mean it's something that I obviously do and something that I talk about and something that impacts my life but it's not anything that I ever thought I would coach around but I decided to watch the video for whatever reason and um, it brought together all of these elements that were important to me and he brought them all together and wrapped them up around food and the way he talks about food and the emotional connection we have just it made so much sense, and um, I signed up, I think, the next day. I got into the program thinking, man, I really hope that these high expectations of what I think I'm going to get, I'm going to get. And I was nervous at first because, again, I just kind of saw how this could potentially pull all these things together for me and was afraid that it might fall short. And it surpassed my expectations on so many levels. It was Literally, lecture to lecture, I would find myself in this space where I was dealing with something or was faced with something, and that's what he would be talking about that day that I sat down to take that lecture. The vocabulary that I learned from the training and the concept of not fixing people. I'm a perfectionist by trade, um, and I've let go of a lot of that and want to let go of my need to help people fix themselves. But yeah, I've become a lot more present, not only in the company of a meal, but with my friends and just kind of life in general, and um, have started noticing a lot more visual connections between how people talk about food, how they play with their food, um, how I do the same thing, and just kind of then playing back in my head Mark's voice based on everything that we're learning, and you can start to connect dots just by watching someone's interaction at a restaurant or at your dinner table, and it's amazing and gives me insight into being able to help myself and my friends, let alone clients.